Sustainability with Kettleman Vodka. Project Dutch Mule. My name is Igor and I'm a senior bartender on board Celebrity Equinox. In the next video we're going to show you why our cocktail, the Dutch Mule, is better than the others in the terms of sustainability. Sustainability, it's a global movement that's actually divided on three pillars. Economical, environmental and community. For our Dutch mule made with Kettleman vodka, we're gonna start with our first ingredient, which is the lemon. Why we choose the lemons? Because lemons are always in season in the Caribbean. That means we are affecting our two pillars of sustainability, which is reducing the cost of flying expensive ingredients to the Caribbean and also the transportation of that other expensive ingredients affect with pollution to our environment. So for our Dutch mule, we're gonna start with our main ingredient, which is the Kettleman Vodka. One and a half ounce of the Kettleman Vodka. Next, we're gonna move to our sugar syrup, homemade, which is quarter ounce. Sugar syrup is made from a sugar cane, which is also very commonly and widely found in all Caribbean. Moving to our fresh lemon juice, half ounce. Usually whenever we use some of our ingredients and the fresh fruits, sometimes we're not using the whole ingredient. And this project with sustainability and Kettleman Vodka inspired us differently. We used the whole lemon before just to make a juice and then discard the skin. So what we decided to do is to have one space on the ship for food preparation room where we actually first peel the lemon and then we use the skin for garnish. Part of that is used also in the galley and part of that is used in one of our restaurants where we make homemade limoncello. And now we are just left with the lemon fruit, where I can actually juice it and have the fresh lemon juice on board. We're gonna put ice in our shaker and shake it. Open up. And our last ingredient is gonna be our homemade ginger beer. Just topped it up. Instead of having ginger beer brought on the ship in aluminium cans, we decided to utilize all our equipment and make homemade ginger beer. Because ginger beer is not widely available for everybody in the world, but ginger grows everywhere. For our homemade ginger beer, we are gonna need the following ingredients. 150 grams of ginger, the skin of two lemons, the juice of three lemons, and four tablespoons of brown sugar. We're gonna add all these ingredients and muddle them together. For this cocktail, we decided not to use copper mugs. Because we are following United States public health regulations, if we're gonna wash the copper mug, it's gonna become green, it will start to oxidize, which is toxic. So that's why we decided to use regular glass. So we're just gonna put our glass, strain our cocktail into the glass, and we're gonna garnish it with fresh mint spring. And now we're gonna talk about third pillar in sustainability, which is the community. For us on board, community is divided on two. First is our team, and the second one is our guest. So just by educating and training our crew members, just by decreasing our waste, imagine we are one ship, and how much waste goes in one week. If we are able to decrease a little bit of that, we are making a difference. Because in one year we have 52 weeks, which is for us 52 cruises and we have 10 ships. If we apply this term of sustainability together with Kettle One Vodka on our 10 ships, imagine how much waste we're gonna save so we're not affecting our environment and also with result of saving our costs. Our second part of the community is our guests. For our guests, on a daily basis, we're doing a mixology classes, which lasts for one hour. It's an interactive program where guests come behind the counter with us and make cocktails. And always one of those cocktails is the Dutch Mule. And we apply the method of sustainability together with them. 
and we teach them how to make their own ginger beer, how to maximize the cost and how to create less waste. So we're not only teaching our crew members, but we're teaching also our guests. So now that movement of sustainability has become more global, it's not only the crew members, it's also the guests, because guests for us come all over the world. thank Kettle One Vodka for challenging me to make a video of sustainability which has become a very global movement and I hope you enjoyed this video. That's it? Or something more? <laughs>